This is the Real House Produce Garden on October 21, 2015, and we're ready for winter. We're passing through the raspberry bushes. Over here on the left, we have beds 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, all the way up to bed number 30. Looking here to the right, we have beds 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, etc., all the way to bed 29. We've taken these beds and raised them during the summer. We actually raised the first 16 beds. We had corn in the first eight beds and then potatoes in the subsequent eight beds. What we've done is we've raised the beds by lowering the paths and then the darker soil that you see at the top of each bed uh, there's a lot of uh, aged cow manure in that. The bottom of the bed is still the gray soil that was in the original flat beds. Our goal here is to more or less keep them undisturbed. We're going to plant things in them and then just remove what we planted without redigging. Definitely not rototilling. And so here we come to the end of the beds. Beds 29 and 30 are really our storage beds. What's here over on the right in bed 29 are uh, remains of sod from our parking lot garden when we uh, created that as well as we've thrown lumps of uh, large lumps of the aged cow manure on top of that. We have some uh, these are turnips. We're going to look at those in a moment. These are turnips that the turnip seeds that we just tossed in here and we have some soil that we're able to retrieve when we made the parking lot garden and this is our starting pile of uh, leaves for the coming year and last thing i just want to show you is uh, let's go look at some turnips some turnip and i think this is the one there's some in the shade now 